welcome back to my channel. Today I am back with a haul, but actually an, an American haul because I know that you guys love them and I've actually been in the States for quite a while. Quickly before we get into this video, what do you think of my new glasses? Do you prefer these ones or do you prefer the old ones? Let me know in the comments below and in the poll. Somewhere it's on the screen because I can never remember what side it is. Anyways, I'm going to take these off because I know that they will reflect. Let's get into this video. I hope you guys do enjoy. Smash a big thumbs up if you guys do and subscribe down below and obviously let me know your favourite thing in this haul as well and uh, without further ado let's get into the video so I actually wore this when I was actually out in LA I had so many comments asking Saffron where did you get this from this spotty set here I also did actually wear the blazer like in a video I think it looks so cute together it comes with the shorts and then also you have the blazer which makes it so nice and looks so cool honestly you can wear this for pretty much anything love this set so much it's from Topshop and I will leave the link down below the next thing I got I think you're gonna um, notice that I'm really obsessed with polka dots. Polka dots is kind of my thing. I got this really cute like crop which I thought was so pretty. It has like frills. I actually wore this with like denim shorts. It wasn't too pricey. Maybe it was like $10, $12. That's a lie. I think it was $14. The only annoying thing with Topshop is in the US it's so much more expensive obviously because they're shipping from Europe. So it makes it a lot more expensive out there. I kind of wish that I bought some of the stuff out here but I didn't bring enough stuff to the US. I thought like I took this massive of case and I was like oh, I'm gonna have so many clothes to wear and then each day I was like so I've already worn this so I ended up having to buy a load of clothes but I'm not complaining <laughs> one of my favorite shops in LA that my mum and I actually discovered the first time that we visited it's amazing we went in there the second time it just got even better it's like a little boutique shop called Timeless and it is just so cute it's on Melrose and I just wish it was bigger because it's actually such a small store like it's probably the size of my bedroom but mum and I seem to get everything in the store like like, it's amazing. The first thing I want to show you, I'm actually currently living for, like, I, I was going to say obsessed, but we all know I'm ob obsessed with everything. So, <laughs> this is actually the cutest little set ever. It's a co-ord, and I was kind of thinking, maybe I would wear this to somewhere in the city. It might be an option. I think it's so pretty. It's this little top here. I think it kind of comes off the shoulders. It kind of sits, like, diagonally. It looks so pretty. It just ties up at the bow, and I just love this pattern so, so, so much. It kind of reminds me of, like, what I used to wear back when I was, like, four years old but I just think it's so cute and then to go with it is this skirt and it's like ruffled I don't know this kind of reminds me of like a typical American co-op this isn't really something I would pick up or find here in the UK so I just thought this was so sweet and I thought this would look so cute like with curly hair hopefully I'll wear this to Sitsy I'm not entirely sure what I'm wearing yet but it's coming so soon which is so exciting if you're going to somewhere in the city basically it's a big huge convention and I know a lot of you have been like choosing your ballots and who you want to meet and stuff so if you put me down I'm so excited to meet you it's gonna be so 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 much fun and also the best part about it is my new merch drops so basically the day that we go to Sitsu which is the 11th of August and the 12th of August my new merch also drops there as well so basically I'm just gonna have the best weekend ever and I'm so excited to see you guys in the new merch I'm gonna be in the merch so that's why I kind of was like debating the outfit because I was like oh I really want to wear my merch at the same time so I don't know you'll find out anyways moving on I got these trousers which are really cool and actually my friend Harriet I saw her a day after having the exact trousers on and she literally didn't even know that I bought them and I'm really surprised she even found this shop because it's so small. So I got these trousers here and they're so cool. They're very similar to the IMG trousers that everyone is wearing at the moment but I actually tried them on and they, they come up in like massive sizes so when I tried this pair on I was like oh, these actually fit me. So if you're short just like I am then these are perfect. They also like suck you in they're like proper like tight they're like stretchy fit and they're really nice and then they're really baggy but then they also have the elastic case bottoms which is really cool so they make it look really cool you know and then it has like a chain at the back and then this is also what it's like at the front as well with this zip and then the two side zips and then it also has a zip at the back so basically these are really cool really hard to show because they're quite long still um but yeah they're such cool trousers i'm excited to wear them the very last thing from the shop timeless that i got were these really cool shades i actually got them in like a white pair as well but honestly i've just been to wireless i was wearing them all over the weekend and now i have no idea where i put them but really cool like cat eye glasses i just love these at the moment honestly i just love glasses that are just so quirky and cool because i think also it makes such a good instagram these were actually a little bit pricey though. I think they were something like $16. A bit more than what I would normally spend on glasses because I'm not really one to like spend loads on glasses. But they're really cool and they look good in an Instagram post so 
I'm feeling them. I can actually smell this in the brown paper. Like, this is unbelievable. Okay, so basically, Roxy, who I'm sure a lot of you guys know, a good friend of mine, she basically texts me saying, hey, like, if you go to Bath the Body Works, would you mind picking up this candle for me as I really want to get it? So I went and got this candle for her, and then I ended up loving it so much that, got, that I got it myself. We're ripping this open. We're opening it. Mamma Mia, this smells absolutely divine. This candle, so it's banana split milkshake. Not only does it smell like literally heaven in a bottle, it also is just the best thing on the side. Like you guys know, one of my favorite colors is yellow. When this is sitting on the side, I'm just like, goes in my bedroom so well. It smells amazing, like you don't even need to like light this. Moving on, next candle. Oh, okay. Campfire donut everything really everything basically they just smell like pure sugar but that is honestly the scent that i love on my side my favorite part of this haul is actually these shoes that i actually treated myself for my 18th birthday so it's my 18th in literally two weeks i'm so excited i actually decided to treat myself i bought myself something very special and if you want to see me unbox this all buy it whatever you can go and check that out on my vlog i'm sure a lot of you guys would have seen that already say to her that she's um she's not allowed them until she's 18 yeah, well, <laughs> I'm joking. we did say that at first, didn't we? Yeah. And then we was like, wow, well, what's the point? If no, something comes up, then I apologize if you guys have already seen these, but I feel like they're still worth showing again. These are the Louis Vuitton Hills. I don't actually know what type these are, but I remember seeing them in the UK and I was like, I want those so badly. And they had sold out. So when I saw them in the US, I knew that I wanted to buy myself something special for my 18th birthday. And so I spent my money on these. And honestly, I don't regret it a single bit. So life is great. We went to this shop and I I have no idea what it's called, but it was above JD. That's all I remember. I will find out what it's called. I'll leave it on the screen or I'll pop the logo or something. Basically, they sold that really cool, like, sportswear stuff. So I actually picked up quite a few bits. First of all, I picked up this sports bra that I thought was so cool. They actually sold this in Nordstrom as well. Obviously, you know that I'm obsessed with polka dots. It's really cool because nothing on this crop top goes, which is what I love about it so much. And then on the back, it also has, like, palm trees. Also picked up these leggings, but I got them from the same shop and I thought they were really cool. They're just black high-waisted leggings. My favorite things to wear. They're super stretchy and I love the three stars and actually it really reminds me of Givenchy. The next thing is super filthy because I wore this on the way back and I was saving it for this video and really I should have washed it but I haven't. I got this jumper and I thought this was so cool because Hello Kitty and Puma have collaborated. Like what is life? I got this jumper. I thought it was really cool. It just has the Hello Kitty and the Puma logo um, but then on the back it has a massive version with a little milk carton and it's just so cute and I just needed it because it was the cutest thing ever so I'm gonna wear this quite a fair bit it's also really comfy and I got it oversized so I can kind of wear it like as a jumper dress back to top shop I picked up this striped rainbow bandeau then I got some camis pretty boring but basically just colors that I've never seen before I went to an event and it was a 90s theme and I actually had the jacket that matched this and I literally had like two hours to get an outfit so I saw this skirt and I was like you know what I think this is so cool. It would look so good with the jacket, really funky. Kind of fit the theme. I mean, I didn't really have that long to get, kind of get an outfit together. But let me tell you, I got so many compliments on this. Again, the only thing is though, it's so much more expensive in the US than it is in the UK. Like the jacket of this, I remember buying it at home and it was 90 pounds. Yeah, actually in America, it was $260, which breaks my heart a little bit. But the skirt, unfortunately, I did pay a little bit more for, but it was worth it because I needed an outfit for that party and it looked really good. I also picked up these little shorts that were by Nike again. They're just really stretchy, really comfy. I wore these in the day and to the gym. And then I also picked up these pillows that are actually behind me. I love these so much. Honestly, I saw them and I was like, mom, I need to try and get this back to the US because honestly, we had no space in our suitcase. So we had to get like, you know, those bags that like squash them down. And um, I managed to get these home and they will be featuring in my videos. And they are from Bed Bath & Beyond, which is my favorite shop ever. 
Why don't we have it in the UK? I do not know. This is what the other one looks like. It's pretty much the same thing, but a little bit smaller. Then, of course, I picked up some of my makeup favourites. So I got my two favourite Anastasio glosses. One in the shade Butterscotch and one in the shade Toffee. Honestly, the best thing ever. I'm wearing Toffee on my lip right now. And then I got this palette by Marc Jacobs. This actually isn't the new one because I thought I had, like, used more pan than I had. But I got a backup one because you can't get this in the UK. So basically, I got a new version of this which I'm so happy about. Then from Topshop picked up this bodysuit. So I think, again, you can actually get this in the UK. This is actually a swimsuit, but I actually wore this on like a shoot thing that I went to and it looked really cool and I would wear this to like a festival. And then I think this might actually be the last thing that I got from Topshop because I know I went kind of Topshop crazy. I picked up these coral shorts that actually really remind me. I don't know if you've ever seen Jane the Virgin, but it reminds, mum, what's her name? Blonde hair, come on, come to me. It's something with P, isn't it? It's like Patricia, isn't it? Yeah, it's not Patricia. So as you can tell, mum... Petra! Okay, Petra. Petra's her name. So if you watch Jane the Virgin, don't these remind you of Petra? Like, to a T. This is something she would 100% wear. If she hasn't worn these yet, she definitely will be. If you don't watch Jane the Virgin, 100% recommend. I bloomin' love that series. Then I picked up this jumper that I actually got from H&M. And I thought this was so cool. And I have a feeling a lot of you are actually really gonna like this. So it's a really nice colour. It's actually lavender. And I just thought this would be really cool, again, as like a jumper dress kind of thing. Like, I can 100% imagine, like, Ariana wearing something like this with, like, you you know, along me black high boots or something like that. Hey, so you know I actually showed you that black um, Mark Jacobs thing that I got, but I got a new version. Well, I also got this and I've used so much of it already. Because I love that black one so much, I picked up this one, which is pretty much just the white version, just the bronzer version. It's a different kind of bronzer and it smells amazing, like honestly. It smells like you could eat this. I've used quite a fair bit, so yeah. Got both of these to go through now. And so there it is. There is my American haul. You know what? I actually picked up a little bit more than I thought I did. I didn't actually realize how much stuff I got and I still feel like I missed out quite a fair bit as well. To be honest, I, I was out there for like a month. So that is actually why I bought quite a fair bit. And I think that's why I thought I hadn't got that much is because I was there for such a long time. Let me know down below uh, your favorite item that I actually hauled today. I really hope you guys did enjoy. Smash a big thumbs up if you guys did. Subscribe down below. And and last but not least, if you want to go and check out my LA vlogs, pretty much vlogged, I would say, every single day whilst I was out there. So definitely go and check those out. I'll leave them down below. And I'll see you guys very, very soon. Mwah. Bye.